In this video, I'll be showing you how to combine elements on Pixel App. Now, if you use Pixel App as a smartphone graphic designer, you know you know that you have to use different elements to make your designs from text to images, backgrounds, you know, um, um, shapes, you know, icons, or, or your PNGs, you know, those are different elements you have to use on your designs. And now, sometimes, when you are trying to make your designs, you might, you know, have to and be moving one element from one place to the other you know it, it just it just conflicts the old to the old designing process you understand because it's not it, it's difficult for you to actually work on one particular element when it's close to another element so you have to you have to make sure that a particular element is static or together with the same element you wouldn't want to um um you wouldn't want to you know spoil or destroy on your design i don't know let me use that term so you get it so in this video now i want to show you how you can actually combine elements or lock elements without shifting them from their position you know while making use of other elements on your design you know on pixel app so before i proceed with this tutorial make sure you subscribe like this video and drop a comment using the comment section all this will help the youtube algorithm to promote this video to viewers who need to see it so thank you so much now let me take you to my smartphone on pixel app where i want to show you how you can do exactly what i just said right now okay so right now i'm on my smartphone and i'm not going to waste any of your time i just want to show you straight up how you can merge elements on pixel app you know so i'm going to open pixel app right now if you do not have pixel app Make sure you download it after watching this video so you can practice exactly what you have watched or what you've seen right here. Um, Pixel App is free. The app has a lot of potentials, but it's actually free for all Android users. If you're using an iPhone, I'm not sure Pixel Lab is av available for iPhone users, but um, just check um, the Apple Store. You might find it. But if you do not find it, I am very sure, I am very sure there are similar applications just like Pixel App on the Apple Store. So maybe check for that as well. So right now, uh, you know, let's just assume this is a wild background and, um, you know, your elements on Pixel Lab, you know, they range from text to images to, um, to, um, uh, um, um, you know, to icons, you know, PNGs, you know, all those. So let's just, let me design something real quick, real quick. So, um, I'm just going to put something here. Mm. So I'm just going to put something right here. I'm going to insert an image quickly. Okay, so I'll put this here and then I'll just um, write something quickly. Okay, I'll make this uh, dark. And then I'll change the font to something else. So please do not get me wrong. This video is not to show you how to design. You know, I believe you already know how to design. You know, I'm making this video to show you how to combine elements on Pixel App. You know, so um, let me see. I'm going to use this. Uh -huh. So maybe... yeah so this is what i want to do then let me just say i'm going to add this um i'm just going to put click there click here So basically what I'm trying to show you now is by the time you are trying to design, you know, for instance, 
as you can see this click here button there are two elements there which is the click here text and then the um shape behind the text now those are two different elements now just because you want to touch for instance if you want to touch the shape instead of the text you might you know mistakenly touch the text instead of the shape you know and that is very very annoying so right now i just want to show you how you can go about a situation like this you know you get it so that is exactly what i want to show you so uh, i'm coming let me just set up the little design okay so let's say this is what i want to design very quickly now if i do not want this um 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 text to be separated from this shape all i need to do is come to come to this button right here you know and then i click on this button right here and then i click on this and this and then i click on this button right here below the phone you can see are you sure you want to merge the selected object yes i want to merge it so i will merge that so once i merge it they have become you have become one element you know and i don't need to be scared that oh i, I will shift shake um shift the text from the image and all that you can see um i can also even combine this image right here this shape right here this yellow shape with this image all i need to do is click on this click on this click on both of them and merge so they become one you see i can move them all around as you can see it is that simple it is that simple you know so that's how you merge um images um you know all your elements together and also there's something else i want to show you um for instance if you don't want to merge let me say you just like this are you shocked text right here you don't want it moving around you know or you can just come here and click on this padlock button so once you click on the padlock button on this particular are you shocked test it stops moving around it means you have locked it to the screen so as you can see no matter how i touch it no matter how other things will move but this one won't move so basically that's it for this video how to merge your element and how to make some static i hope you learned something if you have any questions use the comment section to talk to me i look forward to hearing from you bye bye